So the point here is, yes, when you shout, you can command people's attention, but it's not going to be sustainable because when you keep on shouting, you're going to threaten them. But you can lower your voice and just modulating your voice can make a commanding presence. So John, voice coaching wise, how do I lower my voice? Right? What if pinanganak ako na bosses ipis or bosses butike? So one way to capture how low your voice can get is you have to squeeze your voice box or your larynx. So do this for me. Try to put your head downwards, make a bow, and then try speaking. Notice your voice is going to go deeper now. See that? It gets deeper. Tonight at home, you can lie in bed in a sofa. You can hear also a deeper voice. Okay? That is how your voice can go deepest. Now, John, how can I make my voice deeper? So here's the trick. When you're doing this day by day, and this can happen for weeks or months, by the way, day by day, week by week or months by months, slowly, while you're still speaking, tilt your head upwards. So maybe first phase, it could be like this. Second week, second month, third month, up until, look at how I'm doing it. So even if I'm not tilting my voice now, I know how to make my voice even sound deeper. But of course, that's because I've been trained. I've been doing a lot of voice coaching for the longest time. In your case, it will take months. It can take years for some people to make their voice even deeper. Kasi ang wag mong gawin is, kapag nakaganyan ka, hi everyone, you're gonna look stupid. Right? Obviously, you're gonna look stupid. But that is how you find the equilibrium. You have to make your voice deeper. Here's another trick. You're calling the hotline of an airline and you're not getting the right attention, maybe because they're not taking you seriously, you know what's the best way to sound more commanding? Lower your voice. They will treat you more seriously in that conversation. You're at the hotel concierge. They're not treating you seriously because you look It's a very posh five-star hotel, and it doesn't look like you're rich enough. And that is wrong, by the way. But let's pretend they're like that. You know what's the best way to be more commanding, even if you don't need to change your clothes? Change your voice. The moment you sound deeper, you will sound more intelligent also. You will sound more commanding. So questions such as, May sayo ka ng smoking room, ha? Gusto ko ganito yung room ko. It sounds petty. It sounds like Mickey Mouse versus, Miss, I'd like to request peace for a non-smoking room. You sound more commanding. You sound more authoritative. So lower, deeper voice gives you that confidence. Because it's not just your choice of words, it's also your packaging. Remember, the world is all about packaging. 